Okay, drone pool here. Uh, excuse my messy work area. I've been working. So, here's my Hubson Zeno. And I've done a battery mod to it. Now, before I even get started, I need to say that I am in no way taking credit for this battery mod. It's not something I came up with. I found a video on uh, the QC Guys channel where he did this mod, and I just copied what he did. I followed his lead and did the same thing. So credit has to go to Chris for this mod, not to me. So I just want to make that clear from the beginning. So the reason why I chose to do this mod, my original Hubson battery swelled up to where it cracked the plastic on the housing. So then I, I bought this replacement battery, and after about four flights, the cell went bad. I'd get four minutes of flight, and that was it. Um, I tried recharging it and trying to get that cell to come up. I took it out in the backyard, just let it hover for a few minutes, and it just power shut off and fell. So I did not want to give Hubson any more of my money. I was ready to throw this thing in the trash. And then I came across uh, Chris's video, and I thought, well, I can probably do that. So this is the battery I'm using. Here's a better picture of it. It is a 3000 milliamp 11.4 LIHV battery. Okay. So what I did was I watched Chris's video from beginning to end. Then I went back and started it again. And I did each step as he did it on the video and paused it where I needed to do. So it wasn't that bad. Um, and the battery, it fits in here pretty tight. I mean, it's not coming out. You gotta pull it out. Got a piece of cardboard in here for the bottom. And then I do use a piece of Velcro right here to help keep the battery in. Wherever it's at, it's right here. So there's no way this battery's gonna come out. Just kinda shove it in here. So it goes through both sides. And just in case it comes, but it ain't coming out. It ain't coming out. So, yeah. So that's why I did the mod. So now I'm ready to go out and test it. Hopefully it works. So let's go out to the field and see if this thing will fly with this battery mod. All right. Don't pull signing out for now. Oh, and I'll put a link in the description down below for the battery that I'm using, and I'll put a link down below to Chris's video um, showing how to do this mod. Okay, thanks. Okay, I got my Zeno out here with the battery mod. And let's see how she does. And I only have one bar on my camera. Now the main thing with this flight is just a test. And to um, just watch the telemetry, watch the battery, See if everything works normal. And of course, I forgot to put an SD card in. And so far, the battery has not moved at all. The battery level. But the drone is sitting pretty good. It's moving a little bit, slight breeze. I did a compass calibration.
battery level has still not moved from 100%, so that kind of makes me nervous. Huh. I mean, it's flying. Seems like it's doing okay. I wish I would have remembered an SD card. Okay, now the battery goes down to 99%. Now, this battery's only been charged once, the initial charge. So I'm not sure what kind of flight time I'll get out of it. And, um... I'm sure with a few more charges, it should do better. Now it's acting decent, 98%. That's nice. Been up in the air over four and a half minutes, down to 85%. So, Barring a catastrophe and a major failure, seems like everything's working good. Like I said, I'm just keeping it close because this is just a test. Eighty-five percent. So at this rate, it looks like I can probably get, you know, close to 20 minutes. Which would be nice. It's doing all right. 66%. That eight minute mark. Thereabouts. I mean, it's a little chilly out here right now. And I'm sure uh, after a couple more charges of this battery, it might help improve the flight time. I've never ever gotten these maps to look to work. I don't know why. Never had the maps work. I need to figure that out. Sixty three percent at the nine minute mark. Forty-five percent, twelve and a half minutes. Twenty-one satellites. I'm going to go ahead and bring her in to set her down. All right, so there she is. Just brought her in. About 13, 14 minutes. With 55% battery left, 54. Um, I just kept it close because I was just testing this out. And um, she flew fine. She was solid. No toilet bowl. Um, battery telemetry, I think, was fine. It didn't drain fast. I didn't notice anything in the app that was quirky. Um, she handled fine. So, uh, I think this mod is a success. So, all right. I appreciate you guys watching. This is Drone Pool. I'm going to sign out.